the, the private sector has a lot of value to add, right? And we want to work with the public sector. You have opportunities to open up doors um, with government, with policy that, that I never will have because you're the U.S. government. Um, and, you know, I made this comment and I think I maybe offended some people, but we, we so focus on farmers, we so focus on farmers, which is fine. I mean, I hear constantly the value chain, the value chain, yes, they're a plug in the value chain, but if we camp out on farmers and we don't focus on anything else, then in, in reality, we're not addressing the value chain and you're only bloating one link in that value chain. Um, so I think that, that from the NGO public sector standpoint, you have to get outside that box and look at a holistic approach and say, okay, if development is literally from, from A to Z, we have a pretty good handle on A, right? We, we know how to work with farmers. Um, and I think that's just kind of, uh, I think that's known, right? Maybe that's comfortable. I don't know, maybe that's comfortable. Um, to get outside the box and, and look up the chain and really focus on how can I open up policy change? You know, how can, how can we have real dialogue with, with business people? And how can, how can we cut this, this, this public sector lingo that private sector people don't understand um, that sounds very robotic and get to the, the issue. We're, we're humans, we're, we're trying to come up with the same solutions, right? You're on this side of the table, I'm on this side of the table, but the solution's in the middle and we just gotta have an open, honest dialogue about how to make that happen. And what I can bring to the table and what you can bring to the table, focus on your strengths, I focus on my strengths and at the end of the day, everybody wins.